Holly Willoughby has taken to Instagram to share a cryptic post about letting go of negativity, as she enjoys her summer holidays. This morning presenter Holly Willoughby, 40, has taken to Instagram to post a cryptic message about letting go of negativity. The post comes as the mother of three is taking the summer off from her ITV presenting duties alongside co-star Philip Schofield. In view of her 7.3 million followers, the blonde bombshell posted the cryptic extract, which was taken from her forthcoming book. She wrote, letting go of the judgment and the negativity makes space for love and kindness and a passion for everything around you and what you do. Fans of the star flocked to the comments to applaud Holly for her words of wisdom. One social media user who the message clearly resonated with was Peter Crouch's wife, Abby Clancy, who simply left a row of heart emojis. Taking to the caption. Holly revealed that the quote was an excerpt from her upcoming book, Reflections. She penned, I can't believe that Reflections is out in less than three months. I'm so excited to start sharing some snippets with you all. Hands up if this resonates with you, Holly added, mysteriously. She went on to give fans information about where they can order her book. Recently, it was revealed that former Good Morning Britain host Piers Morgan had sent the broadcaster a message after a magazine suggested they could be the dream team who could save the ITV breakfast show. Holly and Piers, can they save GMV? screens the new cover of Woman magazine, Piers wrote in his Mail Online column. I wouldn't hold your breath for this particular TV dream team. He went on to write that he sent a text to Holly saying, I want the biggest dressing room. Unfortunately, Piers said that this morning star quickly refused his offer in the most brutal way. Holly told him, you can have it. I won't be there. Piers quit his role as co-host on GMV in March after clashing with co-star Alex Beresford over his comments regarding Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's interview with Oprah Winfrey.